Hey there, welcome to Freshdesk. Let's take a quick tour of our help desk. Once you've configured your mailbox, all your emails will get converted into tickets. You can view them in the ticket section. The tickets tab contains tickets from all your channels like Twitter, Facebook, phone, and email. You can sort the tickets better with the ticket filters. For example, you can filter tickets based on a particular agent or view high priority tickets. You can even search in filters in case of multiple ticket fields. Change the status of tickets, assign them to agents and agent groups without leaving the page. In addition to the card view, you can also switch to the table view that gives a quick glimpse into the ticket details. To work on a particular ticket, click on it. This will take you to the detailed ticket view. Over here, you can view the entire conversation between your customers and your agents. Above each ticket, the tool shows the status between the ticket and the time by which it is due. This is determined by the service level agreement or the SLA, which is set by the administrator. You can categorize ticket with tags of your choice. You can reply, add a note, forward and discuss through team huddle with your fellow agents. Add and edit ticket properties in the properties section. The context pane shows ticket relevant information such as data from the CRMs, previous tickets, time logs and other custom apps. The jump to ticket button opens a quick view of the tickets list. Use navigation controls to move to your next ticket from this view. Alternatively, hovering over the ticket subject gives a preview of the ticket. Send quick replies or add private internal notes from the preview. The dashboard is designed to give you a bird's eye view into the health of your help desk. The ticket trends graph reports hourly ticket volumes. The dashboard also provides key metrics like the number of tickets resolved, average response time and SLA maintenance. Admins can view ticket metrics for specific products and agents group on Freshdesk. Agents can easily create tickets, contacts and companies from the new button on the top bar, which is accessible from all the pages inside the help desk. The powerful search function can bring results from different sections of the help desk like tickets, contacts, solution articles and forums. With this, you can start running a basic help desk on your own. As more tickets start coming into your help desk, the rest of your team can hop on to help manage customer service. You can add them as agents by clicking on the agent icon in the admin tab. Now that you have your team ready, you can start automating repetitive tasks by using simple automations on Freshdesk. You can use the dispatcher to categorize, prioritize and assign tickets to the right agents in your support team. Supervisor lets you check on tickets every hour and the observer triggers actions based on changes in tickets. Scenario automations can be used to execute a set of operations on a ticket with just a single click. Additionally, to save time, you can send out canned responses to repetitive queries. Freshdisk lets you monitor Twitter for all tweets and direct messages that talk about your brand and lets you talk to all your customers proactively. You can monitor keywords and convert them to tickets on a selective basis. Similarly, your Facebook page can be added to Freshdisk and used to convert wall posts, comments, and messages into tickets. You can use our integrated live chat section to talk to customers and help them out in real time. Click on the toggle switch that says enable chat to switch on the chat widget. In addition to reaching out via multiple channels, your customers can go through the solution articles in the knowledge base. Once you have an extensive collection of articles ready, you can promote self-service to save time for your customers and bring your ticket volume down at the same time. All the knowledge base articles get indexed automatically and will be recommended to your customers when they try to create a ticket in your support portal. Finally, you can set up community forums to give a platform to your customers to share ideas and give feedback. It's an integrated part of your support and lets you have all relevant conversations taking place on your own turf. Forums are always a great way to engage your customers and enable them to help each other with valuable tips. They can also be used to keep your customers updated to let them know of the latest capabilities and features. We hope this walkthrough has been valuable to you. Thank you for your time.